some viewers may find the following video disturbing. Viewer discretion is advised. Well, hello and welcome back to the channel, everybody. In today's video, we find ourselves in Oregon with the softard known as Adam Starr. Now, you may remember this guy from this particular video right here where he screams like a banshee after his window goes bye-bye. And, uh, yeah, he still hasn't learned anything from that event right there. So much so that he doesn't seem to understand the concept of speeding on the roadways. Yeah, real danger to the society this guy is. So let's go ahead and sit back, relax, and enjoy watching this idiot, well, take another dive. What leads you to believe I'm engaged in commercial activity? And what gives you this idea that a commercial reason is the only reason you need for a driver's license to begin with? Because Washington State, just like any other state in the union, uh, has different classifications for their driver's licenses. Everything from a regular driver's license down to commercial. So can you provide that reason right there? Wait a second. Wait a second. Why am I asking him? I know he's a complete idiot. I mean, it's just a thought running through my head, I suppose. You say anything about commercial activity. I'm stopping you for speeding. So is that a crime? Speeding? No. Yeah. Attempt to elude? Yes. Okay, how can I attempt to elude when I'm not running? Because like, you're not giving me any driver's license. What leads you to believe I'm engaged in commercial activity? Huh? What leads you to believe I'm engaged in commercial activity? Okay. What have I done? All right, explain it to you. I'm sorry, officer, but uh, yeah, this guy's brain waved bye-bye to him a long time ago when he fell for all this sovtard nonsense so therefore he doesn't understand the concept of uh, speeding or uh, personal responsibility or anything of that nature i mean they're foreign concepts to him i wonder how he manages to hold a job when he doesn't have any ability for personal responsibility to begin with like, where, where do even did you see allegedly see me? Huh? Where'd you allegedly see me? Market Street. I'm trying to catch up to you since Market Street. Oh, really? BS. Yeah. Where? Did you not see me sitting on the overpass, sir? Market Street? <laughs> you were not. I was. So that's so that's why you almost passed passed me and then decided that you'd stop me. Because you didn't just get directly behind me. So what was it, a call? Huh? You get a call from somebody? Oh, so now it's a call. You're lying then. No, I told you that. <sighs> I got to that part yet. You just said somebody called. Somebody did call. Okay, so you weren't sitting on an overpass. So I was sitting there watching for you and you went by me at 80 miles an hour. Okay, why I'm stopping. was I passing someone or what? Yeah, you're passing everybody. Okay, so am I not allowed to overtake anybody? Not at 80 miles an hour. How do you overtake someone? Oh, I don't know, maybe going faster than the other person, or in the case of speeding, going faster than everybody else on the road. But of course, your brain is so filled with lead paint chips that that concept completely escapes you, doesn't it? Okay, once again, are you going to comply with my all four requests to get out of here? I'm trying to understand why I'm under arrest. What crime have I committed? I'd just like to be free to go. I haven't, have I committed a crime? Yeah. What crime? <sighs> Why? I'm trying to get to work. I'm trying to get to work. Are you a sergeant? Are you a sergeant? I was, <laughs> I want to know why I'm under arrest. I'm trying to get to work. Well, dude, the timeline of events apparently has already been 
given to you. Somebody called in a report on some idiot speeding, and this officer happened to see the description of the vehicle on his computer, which uh, fit with your this description of your vehicle, and he had to race to catch up with you, and he had to try to pull you over, and uh, when you refused to do so, that became eluding, so he got you for speeding and eluding, so... What part of that do you not understand? I mean, uh, has that lead paint just uh, rotted away uh, your ability to reason this kind of thing? I mean, let us know. Please let us know. Hi, how are you? I, w I was doing fine until... Can you roll this window down for me? I can't. Okay. So I'm Lieutenant Zoner with the State Police. Okay, I'm recording our conversation. Okay. Are you recording our conversation? Yes, sir. Okay, very good. So I need you to get out of the truck. I I'd like to know why. Okay. I, w I, w I was Super sick... I already told you that you were under arrest, correct? I, he... <laughs> And I signaled to him like 30 times that I'm pulling over somewhere safe. Give me one second. I'm, I, there was no exits. Okay. Do I, have, do I have the right to pull over somewhere safe? Okay, of course you do. Okay. Why is he under... Why am I under arrest for... Okay. for in, well, in, well, I'll tell you what. If Whether you go to jail or not or get a citation is up to you. But if we, well, we, that we, sounds we like at a, least need you to get out. That okay. sounds like a threat. No, it's not a threat. Well, if I get out, then you're going to arrest me and I'm not going to be able to go to work. Okay. Nobody said that. So can you at least just get out of the truck for me? If I could trust you guys, I would. Okay. You can trust me. I don't. I, Are you on it, you? Am I doing anything wrong? No. I'm just trying to have you get out of the truck. So can you get out of the truck? I don't feel safe getting out of the truck. I need to go to my work. Okay, what's your name? I've got tons of tools. What's your name? I use the name Adam. Okay. Well, what's your, what's your legal name? I don't understand. What do you mean? What's what my legal, legal name? name? What is the name what's on the... your driver's license? I... What is the name on your driver's license? I don't... If I if I had a license, would that be me on the license? Oh, no. You're one of those guys. Uh, yeah, you think that uh, the driver's license is your corporate self and the uh, uh, person on there is not the living self? Or something like that, you bonehead. Uh, no, uh, that's merely a picture of who you are. It's supposed to be with you at all times when you drive on the roads, when you get pulled over. That way they can identify who you are. I mean, you're making this thing way overcomplicated, dude. I mean, it's, you're just making something out of nothing at this point. What's your license number? Again, is that mine? Okay, you have to show you have to show proof of of that you're able to drive, right? You have to show identification. It, it, do, what stuff, what's right? this, what this leads you to hold on? This is a lawful traffic. Okay, stop. what leads you to believe I'm engaged in commercial activity? So, okay, is there anything that I can say that's going to let have you get out of the vehicle? Is there anything that I can do right now that will make you get out of the vehicle? <sighs> Not take me to jail. I'm trying to get to work. Okay. So unlock the door so that you can get out of the vehicle. Okay. I don't trust you guys. Okay. How about Dude, I'm trying to go to work. Okay. What is wrong with me going to work? Okay. You need to get out of the vehicle. Okay. What have I done wrong? Okay. Who did I violate? You're required to show proof of identification on a lawful traffic stop. It, 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 if I'm suspected of a crime. Okay. Uh, dude, uh, how many times can you be wrong in one video, considering that Washington State does require you to present your driver's license upon demand at a traffic stop, according to this statute right here? I mean, do you even bother to uh, read these things? I suppose not. I suppose uh, reading English is not exactly your forte is it i mean you must read a uh, fluent soft hard which is not exactly a language that'll get you through anything in this uh, country right yeah can i get your name i use the name adam adam what's your last name <sighs> what crime do you suspect me of okay. is there anything i can say again that's gonna have you get it that's gonna make you get out of the articulate car? a crime okay sit tight okay adam
I'm not going anywhere. I'd like to. I'd like to just settle this here. Adam, Adam, check this out, though, man. Okay. Just hear me out. Hear me out. I'm trying to go to f work, dude. Okay. I understand you're upset. You look. Upset. I'm not upset. I'm. I'm worried that you guys are gonna not let me go to work. I have thousands of dollars of tools on the job. You guys have. F I don't know how many times. Well, I haven't. Hey, soft hard. Uh, if you've had this many encounters with law enforcement, uh, you may want to rethink your strategy and try to figure out why you are being pulled over so much. Maybe it might have something to do with uh, your attitude. It may have something to do with the fact that you uh, uh, fell for this soft tar belief system. You may want to fix these things before you continuously... Uh, get pulled over and over and over again. I mean, just a thought, just a suggestion, something you may want to consider. No, you haven't, but you're, you're, you guys are all... Okay. This is insane, dude. I've done nothing wrong. Okay. It was a traffic stop, right? <laughs> and I was trying to stop. Okay. But we could we could figure that stuff out. We were, but we're not. You guys are gonna figure out. You just gotta go to jail. Not necessarily. Always, dude. Every time. I deal with people all the time that I don't. I, I, I you know, I would hope, I would hope you have some respect for human, you know. Absolutely, I do. Absolutely. But this is insane, dude. I, I gestured to him like thirty times. I'm stopping. Okay, but. And he's me. trying to arrest me for the one thing I'll tell him. I'm pulling over. Okay, but hear me out. Hear me out. We don't even know who you are. Why are you why are you worried about He he him? used he said the name I use. I heard Adam, right? I used the name Adam. But he said the name that I use. He knows What do you mean the name? He that knows you? the name I use. When? When he walked up to my truck. Okay. What's your last name, Adam? I use the name Adam Star. Star? S T A R? Two R's. Two R's? Okay. I that's the name I use. Okay. Here's the thing, man, is I don't want things to go worse and it would be super... You're telling me? I've, I've been violated. I don't know how many times for you guys. It would, it would be super helpful to you. I need my it. truck. You guys are going to take my truck again. And I don't have the money. When did this happen last time? How long ago? Dude, it happens all the time. Okay. I don't understand what the f*** I've done. Okay. Well, you Nobody's know. even articulated a crime. I just told you, you, you got pulled over for a traffic violation. And nobody's articulated a crime that they suspect me of. Okay. But I think that was already explained that you wouldn't stop when you were, when somebody was behind you. Man, you guys are going to do what you're going to do. You're going to fucking shoot me. Fucking Nobody take me. to shoot you, dude. Yeah. Nobody wanted to fucking assault me either last time. Well, we don't want to assault you either. I mean, it would it'd be simple and it would solve a lot of issues if you just stepped out of the vehicle. Does that make sense? You guys are fucking threatening me! I don't feel safe right now! We're not I really don't think you know what the word threat means. I mean, not one of these officers has even attempted to do that. I mean, uh, are you living in some sort of paranoid delusional fantasy land or something like that, Softard? I mean, uh, it sounds like you need a bit of help on the psychological front as well. Threatening you. Bullshit! This is you're all fucking armed. We're giving you an opportunity. You guys are threatening me right now. We're giving you an opportunity to step out of the vehicle as well. And then consent to you guys kidnapping me. We're not kidnapping you. You are though. If you, were, you will. If you were able to go with the flow, just step out of the. But vehicle. that's you. Get you. Get you. you this is, that's, okay, I will get out if you guys are gonna threaten me. If you guys are gonna break my shit and take my shit and assault, and assault me, I will get out. Okay. You guys are making me nervous. This did not, look, the keys are out of the ignition. The thing okay. is, I'm not going anywhere, but I'm I'm not going to consent to being kidnapped. Now if you can open door. I'm not gonna consent to being kidnapped. We're not I'm not gonna consent to being kidnapped. Please, I'd like to be on. I'd like to be free to go. You are not free to go. I'd like to be free to go. I have done. I, what have I done wrong? If, if what have I do? What, what can we do to get you to open your door without breaking your window? You tell me you're gonna break my window. I want you to open your door. Without okay, wait, wait. This is what you can say. Say I'm going to break your window and assault you, or if you don't get out. 
because the, otherwise you're not gonna break my window and I'll be and you can set and you can you can let me go with a citation. Do you understand me? If you do not open your door, we are going to break your window and forcibly remove you. Do you understand that? Okay, so if I don't get out, so okay, then I'm getting out under threat. I'm getting out. I'm getting out. If you guys are, I'm making sure. Okay, they're breaking my window. They're gonna break my window if I don't get out. I'm getting out. I'm getting out. Okay, here. I'm, I'm, hey, dude, I'm, I, please, you're breaking, dude, you're stop, fucking stop. twisting my arm. Get, I'm, get, I'm, I am so, I am so fucking limp, it's not even funny. You know, it's so amazing that, uh, he changed his tune rather rapidly when he, uh, managed to get them to say, I'll break your window if you don't, blah, blah, blah. I mean, it's as if he's trying to entrap them, maybe get some go away money or something like that. Yeah, clever little idiot. Is that what you're trying to do? Is that what you want? Is that how you operate? You're trying to get yourself a lawsuit? Uh, dude, I'm sure a good lawyer could, uh, rip you to shreds in court if they saw this footage. I mean, that much is as clear as day right there. Oh, boy, you are a freaking moron. Oh, yeah, uh, I, uh, that's what I think, that he was trying to entrap them at this point. Oh, what a moron. So, at any rate, guys, I hope you enjoyed the video. Thanks for watching, and I will see you on the next one. Dude, so there's no way I can get in, bro? Come on, I'll put you on my YouTube. But shut up, Wesley. You gotta put signs up, ma'am, if it's- Are you Glenn Serio? Who's that?